okay, Andrew. It's okay. It doesn't help. Prayers don't help. You can't always be strong. No one expects no, you I to. I have to. I have to be strong for Cassie. She's weak. She's fragile. I don't even think she can handle another. Doctors know what they're doing, but it, it may take time. And time. What about time? What if time's the enemy? What if what if she sinks deeper and deeper into this? She won't. How do you know that? Because she has that? you. And she has all her friends. She has Dorian. Huh. A powerful group behind her. Yes. For all the good that it's done. I have never felt so powerless in my entire life. I don't know how to break through to her. I really don't. Maybe you're trying too hard. Let me talk oh, to her. Oh, come on, Marty. She thinks that there's a conspiracy, that every... I'm part of the whole thing, trying to keep the... her from her baby. I mean, it's just... I know that's what she thinks. You're at but... it again, aren't you? Honey, come on. I every time do... I turn my back, you're together. What you're you plotting against me. Bed, sweetheart, come on. You think I'm naive. You think I don't know that. See, I came to visit you. No, don't you lie to me, Marty Saybrook. You came to gloat, didn't you? Marty's your friend. She'd never do that to oh, you. Oh, so never friend. Do yes, that a friend. Yes, a friend. friend. One who helps you take my baby away from me. You're no friend. Cassie, no, you don't understand. I do understand you, Marty Saybrook. You're with him. You're with all of them. You're no friend. You don't mean it, Cassie. You yes, Andrew, I want her saying. out of here. Cassie. Now, get out! Get out! Andrew, could you leave us alone for a minute? I don't want to be alone with you. Please I don't now, trust Marty's you. Marty's your friend, You know, I know Cassie, that's what you want friend. me to believe, but... Andrew, please. All right. Okay. Cassie, I know how it feels to think that everyone is your enemy. You know, not everyone, Marty. I'm not paranoid. I know who my friends are. Then I hope you'll remember that I'm your friend. Yeah, I used to think you were. Until I find out where your true loyalties lie. With Andrew. No, with you and Andrew. I care about you both. Yeah, I know how much you care about me, Marty. I heard you bragging to Andrew how you humored me. See? Pretending that you were going to help me get my baby back. And the whole time, you were part of the plan to put me here. No, I only wanted you to have the best treatment. I don't need to be treated. I'm not insane. Doesn't anybody know that? You're all against me. No, Cassie, that is not true. No, I, there's no one to count on. There's nothing to live for me. Why bother? Why bother at all? Cassie, you have so much to live for. A husband who loves you. He hates me. Why do you think he put me in this place? Because he loves you so much, he can't stand to see you in pain. St. Anne's, it's a hospital. A mental hospital. And I don't need to be. It's in. a place where people come to be healed. <laughs> you have a down cold, don't you? You and Luna and my mother, it's as if you're all reciting on the same script. Cassie, listen to me, please. You're not going to hear me say that I think your mother's the most trustworthy person in the world. And God knows I've done my share of lying, but I swear to you. We are not lying to you now. We all love you very much, and we just want you to get better. There's nothing wrong with me. All I need is my baby. If we could bring one... Don't! Don't even say that he's dead. You know, that is the biggest lie of all. Cassie, please. No, Marty. I've never hurt you. I've always been kind to you. Why do you want to hurt me like this? I don't want to hurt you. Then tell me the truth. I am. God, and if I could change it, I would. William's dead. He died at birth. It's not true. I found him later in the, on Christmas Eve. Cassie, the baby you found was not yours. And as much as you want him to be, you know the baby belongs to Beth. To me. I love him. I would never, ever abandon him. Of course not. You didn't abandon him. She did. She was scared and confused. She's a child herself. But then she got help. And she realized she loves her baby. She loves him so much she can't be without him. She has to. She has to find her... No, own. baby, you have to. You have to let Beth have her baby back. You have to cry for your own baby that you lost. Please let it go. Just let it go. You're like Andrew and Mother and everyone else. You want me to give up on William. Cassie, no, we just want you to... No, I won't listen. Cassie, you please. What you want about William, but I know what I know. William is alive, and you're trying to keep me away no. from it. Listen to me. You must listen to me. Don't wait. You go away. No, I won't listen.
let you do this to yourself. No, let go of me. No! Not until you let it go. Help me, sister. No, Teresa, somebody help me. me. Listen to me. This is your pain. It's your anger, and I don't blame you for go holding away. Go it's away. Go grief off. But it's killing you, and it won't bring William back. No, I won't listen. I won't listen. No, someone has to tell you because you've got to hear it. You're mad at the world, but the world keeps on going, and if you jump, don't jump back. You on. know, I don't want to keep going, okay? I don't want to jump on. You will die! It's not going to bring William back. Is that going to solve anything? Yes, because it'll make it stop hurting. No. It hurts so no, much. Listen to me. Listen to no. me. You've got to let it go. Give it to me. No. It all to me right here now. No, Please. I can't. Cry. No. Cry for William. Let no. it go. Don't hold back. No. to grow up or go to school or fall in love. I know. I know. And it's so wrong. And I can't hold him. And tell him it's going to be all right. Because it's not right. It can't be right. It'll never be right. Oh, my baby, oh, my William.